local grocery store owner was assaulted and robbed with a wielding knife tonight, according to witnesses in the city of Glendale just hours ago. Local authorities are still looking for the suspect, which only means he's likely still on the run. Our trusted reporter Babkin Kleeryan is on the scene now, speaking with a possible witness. Babkin, are you there? Arab, my name is Babkin Kleeryan, okay? Your name is Dick, right? Okay, you don't hear me calling you Khalid. Okay? Don't screw it up, okay, Arab? We're live on air. Could you please put the cigarette out? Ah, okay, okay. I can look good. Uh, listen, Arab, Dick, uh, I'm reporting live from here, this location, and I have a witness. Come, beautiful lady, come. She's going to tell us uh, what took place today. Uh, what What did you see today, hon? I went to this Armenian store to get some hummus and some rice. And this big old black guy came in with this big old motherfucking knife. I don't know, Machete, I, I don't know what the fuck it was. But I said, uh-uh, not the motherfucking day. Not the motherfucking day. I got to go home. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got no motherfucking time for this shit. Yes, and that's right. You heard that from the witness? Uh, so this was yeah, large man. knife, huh? Shit, the biggest I ever motherfucking seen. Okay, very nice. Okay, thank you very much for your time. Let's see if there is one more word. Uh, come see, come over here. Tell us what you saw today. Okay, go ahead. Tell us, tell let us me, what you saw. Let me tell you what I seen. Okay. What I seen is my ass come up in the store and stabbing every motherfucking body. Motherfucker gonna tell me no. Hell, nobody tells me no. See, I just started stabbing motherfuckers like it was every day. Like it wasn't shit. You did? What? You heard me? I said I started stabbing motherfuckers like it wasn't shit. Babkin, we have reports that the person you are speaking with is likely the suspect, not a witness. I robbed the motherfucking store. Matter of fact, give me your wallet and your wedding ring. My wedding ring? Yes. <laughs> my mother-in-law, Dick, listen, my mother-in-law gave me this wedding ring. If I give this to him, She's gonna kill me and him together. <laughs> no, yeah. you can't have the. No, no, Ara, no. You, you don't scare me, Ara. Come on, I'm married with three kids. Nothing scares me. Matter of fact, give me all your oh, shit. God. Give me oh, all your shit. shit. Dick, Ara, biscuits, Ahmed, biscuits, Ahmed. Oh, oh, shit, he's. Oh, stabbing all night. Oh, shit, Ara. Hold on. Yes, you know. Try not to engage. We have dispatched the police to help you. This is so a and I born in Glen the Lachbet. I put the chocolate lock spalling machbed. Babkin, don't engage Babkin. Please wait for the police, Babkin. Take care of this guy. 15 years of jujitsu, Samsung back a lock, but 10 years of black metal. We're gonna go to a quick commercial here. Let's hope Babkin is okay. Okay, apparently this guy was the suspect. Lavos Kunitz. I've been hit, Dick, I've been hit numerous times, but it's okay. Babkin, how did you manage to subdue the suspect? I defeat this guy. 17 years of Jiu Jitsu, 9 years of black belt, 18 years of Kimbo Slice, and then 45 years of living in Glendale. <laughs> I have reflex like nobody else. Look at my foot come up like this, Akber. Huh? You see, like this fast. Nobody can mess with me. I put him on choke, hold in chef, cannot breathe anymore. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and by the way, you're a dick. This was not a regular knife, Akber. This ho. This was like Pirates of the Caribbean sword, Allah. He stabbed me everywhere. Ben Allah's kuva, Akber. Anyway, I'm gonna need. Medical insurance, they cut my toshak, I have nothing left. <laughs> Reporting live, Bob Ken Kalirian, Laos Kumba. This is Dick Harrison reporting live from downtown LA.